Now we went to evaluate an uh, algebra expression. Basically, is we want to find the value of the expression given that uh, when my variables are given certain values. So what you're doing is you are substituting uh, or putting in your values of x and y into the expression here. Okay, you're putting in the value of x and y into the expression here. Okay, so given that uh, in example 1.3, if I given that x is equals to negative 2 and y is equals to 4, what we are doing is we are putting the value of 4 into this expression here and the value of negative 2 into this expression here. So you just take note that, well, 4 will basically be representing my y, taking over the y here and negative 2 will be taking over the value of x here. So that's what it looks like. So for a, for a, if you take a look, if we let sub x as negative 2 and y as 4, what we are getting is 5. Okay, so 4, remember, we are putting 4. So instead of y, we are putting 4. Minus, because of this minus sign, 4. Okay, the original coefficient. And our x now, originally x was replaced with negative 2. So in case you are still not very sure, let me just put a shadow there. This was originally my y which I have replaced with 4. This was originally my x, which I have replaced with negative 2. Okay? So, similarly, what we do is we just evaluate. Okay? Now, 5 times 4 will give us 20. 4, remember, multiplication bracket comes first. 4 times minus 2 will give us a, a negative 8. So, this is 20 minus negative 8, which is the same as 20 adding to 8 which is equals to 28, okay? And that's our answer for part A, okay? So for part B, we have 1 over x minus y plus 3. So again, remember what we do is we are substituting the value of x here. So our x is now substituted with negative 2, where the original x is now negative 2 over here. My y minus y plus 3, so my y is substituted with 4. 3 again just to show you the original x was here and the original y was here okay so next i evaluate it this is negative half minus 4 plus 3 and your final answer should be negative 3 over 2 okay just evaluate it okay so that's for example 1.3 okay i hope you understood uh, an objective of this example is how to evaluate algebraic expression okay thank you